just about anything from hang gliding to of course surfing. But today under a bright Hawaiian sun with the cliffs of Makapu serving as a backdrop, some of the top professional men and women high divers in all the world will be testing their courage and ability in the mixed target diving classic where the divers not only have to be fearless but have to be extremely accurate as they try to hit this small target below. Now one diver remains, 32-year-old Rick Winters, the last man with a chance to beat Dana Kunze. He was first after his first dive, but he'll need a bullseye here. Three position, back somersault. Nice takeoff and a perfect entry. Another bullseye for Rick Winters. Tremendous dive. Hey, there are you. Right into it, I felt like. Woo. You've been moon. Don't kid me, Rick. You've been moonlighting on the side. All this stuff about a layoff and being a, a homebody. That's a bunch of garbage. <laughs> well, I've been practicing a little ten meter. You know, like I say, you work the first thirty feet. And the next 50 feet just kind of fall in place, you know? When do you make your decision at the top as far as the adjustments you need to make to hit the target? Well, yeah, at the top, but that time, I'm not sure, I'm gonna have to see my films of it, but I felt, it looked to me like it was in front of me and I stuck my feet a little bit in forward, and I felt it more in my rear end, so I think that's what happened. I, I think I was a little bit out, but I stuck my feet forward to it. Target diving championships are won and lost right at the start. He leaves the platform and now he begins to spot the target. Tucks here, straightens out. He's a little shy, but he has the presence of mind to reach for it with his toes. And it makes the difference here. Mr. Rick Winters! So Rick Winters with his wife and young daughter in attendance, the winner of this mixed target diving classic. Dana Kunze finishes second, and Rick Charles third, Patty Davis was fourth.